What's up everybody, this is Karai Code, and in this video, I'm going to show you guys on how to connect your DualShock 4 controller to your PC. So let's get started. You guys are going to need your micro USB cable that came with your controller. Otherwise, you can also connect with Bluetooth, which I'll be showing you that in a video. Alright, so the first step you guys are going to want to do is go to a website called ds4windows.com. I have a link in the description. But once you're here, click on the green download now button and let ds4windows.zip download. Once you guys got that done, go into your downloads folder. Then you guys are going to right click on DS4 Windows and click the option that says extract all and click extract again. Now if you guys are on Windows 7, you have to download WinRAR and extract it from there. But um, once you guys are here, double click on a DS4 Windows application and click run. Then you're going to click on program folder. And you guys are going to notice when you first open up DS4 Windows, it's going to ask you to update. So make sure you guys cl click on yes, and then click run again. And then click OK. Now, on the top left corner of your screen, you should see the DS4 updater downloading. When the download is complete, just click on open DS4W button. And then wait for the program to open. Now from here, all you guys got to do is click on step 1, install the DS4 driver, and then click install again. If you guys are on uh, Windows 7, just click step 2, otherwise don't click step 2 at all. So click finish. Now you guys are going to plug in your controller to your PC. And you should see your controller flash orange once. And now you guys are going to click on the controllers tab, but wait! You guys are going to notice that your controller isn't recognized. This is perfectly normal. All you guys have to do is click stop and close DS4 windows and launch it again. And you should see your controller is connected. And your controller should be blue now. And that's it. Um, if it doesn't work, make sure you guys uh, use a different cable or a different port. It should connect. But otherwise, um, only minimize DS4 windows. Never close it. If you guys are gaming, always leave the DS4 windows application running until you're done. Alright, so what if you want to connect the controller with Bluetooth? I'm going to show you guys on how to do that, but you guys got to make sure you have a Bluetooth adapter or a Bluetooth driver in your computer. But once you know that you have Bluetooth in your computer, go ahead and open up DS4 Windows again. From here, just click on Settings, and then click on Controller slash Driver Setup. Then you guys are going to click on Bluetooth Settings, and you should notice your Bluetooth settings open up. Make sure you guys tick on Bluetooth settings. And now you guys are going to hold the middle PlayStation button and the share button at the same time. And you should see your controller flashing white. And once you guys got that done, find your um, controller, the Windows controller, and click pair or wireless controller. If it asks you for a code, the code is 0000. It didn't ask me for a code, but if it asks you guys, the code is basically four zeros. And now when you guys click on controller, you should see it's connected. Again, if it doesn't show, just click stop, close it, and open it up again. And that's it. Thank you guys so much for watching. This was Karai Code. Make sure you guys drop a like below, and I'll see you guys next time.